What's up guys, it's your boy Dark Skin, and today we are going to be going over just how broken Toby Rama's limit break is going to be, and if him getting nerfed in PvP was really a bad thing. Okay, so starting off, we'll go over his stats, and then I'll get a little bit into what I'm talking about. So, um, he's a bravery unit, okay, mid-ranged. Uh, his max level right now is 100. He goes from 60 to 30. That's fine. He's also in the, uh, in the Granny Cat Shop right now. If you guys don't have him, uh, you can get five copies. Um, so you need one more to max dupe. But, uh, yeah, we'll get into the dupes and stuff a little bit later. So, uh, HP, 1744. Goes up to 2000 with pills. Attack is 1300. Goes up to 1400 with pills. And that's fine, but his PvP stats, let's get into it. Alright, so um, his old PvP stats were, um, I think it was like, hold on. I'm gonna try to look it up, but I don't, I don't think it'll pop up, I'm not sure. Uh, I think, I think it might be on the subreddit. Okay, so yeah, okay, so Toby Rama's uh, HP went from 4,000 to 31,000 and his attack went from 2,300 to 1,800. So he lost 500 attack and he lost roughly um, 10,000 HP. Now, I know a lot of people are going to be like, oh, yeah, that it sucks. They nerfed him. He's, he sucks, blah, blah, blah. But think about it like this. Think about it like this, okay? Toby Rama has 30,000 HP, 1,800 attack, 285 speed. I'm going to get into why the, he's busted. Like, if you, like, I know a lot of people thought he was nerfed, but that's because we didn't know what was coming. Like, this man is busted, okay? Matter of fact, um, let me bring up... Going on to his uh, field and buddy skill, right? Let's bring that right there. Uh, yeah, reduces damage by 15 to 20 percent. Boost critical rate by 2.25. That one's kind of useless, but that one's actually good. Sync with bravery. Boost attack by 100, which is really good. Sync with hidden leaf. Reduces wisdom damage taken by 20 percent. That skill. Is a really good way to counter Hinata. That is a really good skill. Then his ability. Boost attack by 100. Reduce chakra consumed by 1. So his chakra cost goes from 6 to 5. And from 12 to 10. Uh, reduce wisdom by 10%. Really good. Increases ninjutsu slash secret technique multiplier by 1. Which is stupid again. Boost attack by 100. So. Now he has a 1600 basic attack. And then his Jutsus are all added by one multiplier. And his Wisdom Reduction by 10. So this man is a really good counter to Hinata. Now, um, if we go to Hinata and look at her... Well, we can finish off. Alright, 5.8 times attack, which would be 6.8 if you had the, that ability. To one enemy in range, it gives you two perfect dodges for two turns. Really good. Uh, 6 to 5. Uh, ultimate. 15 times attack towards all enemies in range, knocks them back, but immobilizes you for four turns, 12 to 10. Uh, that goes to seconds, obviously. Okay, that's fine. Um, now, let's uh, go ahead and... Hold on. Turn around a bit. Okay. Anyways. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and look at Hinata. Okay? We looked at him. Let's look at Hinata real quick. We're not going to look at her PvE stats. We're, this is PvE. We're going to look at PvP. 38,000 HP, 2,100 attack, 343 speed. Okay, off rip. Those? That, like, whose stat? Those those literally resemble Toby Rama's stats before he got nerfed. Okay. Now, the reason why I'm saying that is because... Toby Rama doesn't have a limit break yet. 
So I feel like Bandai nerfed him because they didn't want him to be super broken before his limit break. Now, obviously, once he gets a limit break, he's going to be really strong, and that's fine. His HP could go to 40k. His uh, attack could go to 2300 again. His speed could hit, like, I don't know, like 320. So it's like, you know what I'm saying? Now they're doing something. If we look at one other person. Uh, sorry, guys. By the way, I'm sick, if you guys didn't know. Um, but Sage Mode Naruto, okay? Um, you know, we already know his rank PvE stats are good. You know, 1900, 1900. They both went up by 500. That's really good. Um, but his PvP stats, 28,000 to 36,000. It went up 8,000. 2,200 to 3, uh, 3,000. It went up by 800. 205 to 225. It went up by 20. So, this man, like... He went from mediocre to actually, de like, usable. Because at first, you know, he didn't really have enough HP or damage to um, to weigh out how slow he was and stuff like that. But now, um, with, the, with the higher attack boost he has, um, and then his abilities, he's one-shotting a lot of bravery units. He's hitting for 30,000 on wisdom units, excuse me. He's sitting for like 30,000 on wisdom, wisdom units. He's sitting 20,000 neutral damage. Like, like that's, that's nasty. Sync skill. Reduces wisdom damage. Reduces wisdom damage. Reduces wisdom damage. This is a Hinata counter. Now, the reason why I'm talking about these Hinata counters is simply because Hinata is like the most broken PvP unit. Like, it, like the root of cancer comes from Hinata. Like, the root of cancer comes from Hinata. So, um, these are really good ways for you to counter that. You know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, so like, w w with his limit break and everything, 20,000 neutral damage with uh, max dupes, I believe. And then this gives him a 6 times multiplier, 14 times multiplier, 4 8 chakra. Attack reduction, and then that's like a almost a yeah vast range rectangle for his ultimate jutsu. So think about it. Let's 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 apply Naruto's stats, uh, his limit break to Toby Rama. So 8,000, 8,025. That puts him at thirty nine thousand. Wait, was that eight hundred too? I said eight thousand eight hundred. Okay. That puts him at 2,600. And then that puts him at 310. So 310 speed. 39,000 HP. 2,600 attack. Busted. That dude is stupid. That's that's retarded. Like, that's, that's nasty. He is definitely coming back into the meta once he gets a limit break, bro. It's going to happen. Trust me, that it's going to happen. So, um, I just wanted to talk to you guys about um, Toby Rama being busted in his you know, limit break and blah, blah, blah. But anyways, that's going to be about it for this video. Uh, be sure to give it a like, subscribe to Chill if you're new. Comment down below, tell me what you guys think in the comment section below. And with that being said, uh, oh, I should be streaming the Fighters beta whenever it drops i didn't pre-order it yet i usually pre-order games like right before it comes out because i don't know but anyways so yeah i should be streaming it on twitch or whatever so with that being said i'll see you guys there peace